Oops, 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 oops. <laughs> Why is always this novels or dating sims actually have such a bops music like damn so i'm back this is hardcore cruising it's a dating scene with like monsters and we're gonna you know find us a good uh take god monster boyfriend no <laughs> i mean the point is getting some like at least one right as a boyfriend i hope or maybe an RM. That will be great. <laughs> Jesus, that's a boat. Uh, oh, I, I think that's my name. I can't believe this day has finally come. Embarkation on the high screen. Embarkation? Arkansas? Oh my gosh, she's even girtier and more beautiful than I, w than I saw on the Holopics. My dreams come true, I'll be one of the lucky few chosen to work on the flagship of the Flaming Star Cruising Lines. Oh! <laughs> oh, I even get- <laughs> I better get on board. Damn, first day already missing work. That sounds like me. I bore through a lower deck, so I really don't see much of the ship yet. First task, get into uniform and throw my belongings in my cabin. Hey, this uniform is so cute. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> that is not a uniform. That is literally like a... Ah, I don't know the name of this in English. And this, like... Things are becoming real fast. I'm actually here. Actually, part of the crew. It looks like I'll be sharing the quarters with someone else, I wonder. I wonder who my... my bunkie will be. Oh man, I'm so overwhelmed. I worked so hard for this. I never thought I'd make it. I'm so happy. <laughs> so happy to be a slut. <laughs> my other brothers say I'd never be slutty enough to make it past the first interview. <laughs> but look at me now, I made it, you big jerk. I mean, you know what? We stand. We stand a man that, the, that his goal in life is to be like a slutty uh, attendant in a boat or something. Yes, I I agree. You made it, buddy. But if he's right, what if I'm not slutty enough? Ah, uh, I can start doubting myself. But my mouth is showing and I'm feeling so exposed. I mean, oh, so he's actually naked i thought he had like an underwear or a tongue or something no i won't let him i won't let it fluster fluster me this is why i always wanted exploring gorgeous locals from different planets throughout the galaxy selling through space and seas making a huge amount of money while pleasing most people get to be as ranchy as naughty as i always wanted all the new crew report to tax and store board <laughs> I give him the voice like, um, uh, I don't know if anybody has played like my high school dream best friends forever or something. There's the announcer in the mall that he sounds so like done with everybody's shit. So <laughs> that's what that this is the voice that I'm it is it, 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 the voice that it is in my mind, like the moment I was seeing intercom right away i was thinking of, about making that boys deck seven i gotta go oh damn oh my effing god this ship is amazing look at how fancy it is here we are starboard now super means the right side and bow means the front of the ship i'm glad i set it up on my ship terms <laughs> oh good i'm not the only one out here my pup's throwing <laughs> wait yeah, everybody's about to show it. I mean, that's the point. Hello! Oh my god, damn. I I'm sorry, I was distracted by the text. Uh, the dialogue and... Damn. You're looking... You're looking fine, sir. Arse. <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> Bruh. Alright, okay. Uh, I, I, I guess we're gonna have a lot of innuendos here. 
If this is... I mean, we're starting... Right. <laughs> Yo. Uh. Plumbot. <laughs> oh my god. His eyes. He's so creepy. Dude. Look at this. Oh my god. I mean, I'm, I'm not shaming him. He looks like a nice guy and everything, but... Damn, those eyes. Hi there, you two must be the two new crewmates. We pick up the guinea midi. Oh my god, I'm having flashbacks with this day. <laughs> with another dating sim that I have played. And I haven't posted because that one is... <laughs> you can, you cannot post that kind of dating sim in, in, the, in YouTube, so... I'm Chris Hector Plumbottom. Plumbottom, oh my god. Nice to meet you, I'm Milo. I'm Milo Bear from Earth. And you, sir? Ars, Baranoi Prison. Oh yes, you must be part of the work release program. Welcome aboard! What? Let's see here, Ars. Uh, <laughs> we're going to be the cabin steward with, with our housekeeping staff. Milo, you'll be going to be part of the deck crew. That means you'll work at different stations as needed. You guys have come aboard of the perfect time. We're docked today and tomorrow for our team maintenance, which means there are no guests aboard. This is a perfect time to get your intake done and start your training. I'm sure you're both eager to learn what jobs you'll be doing in your different departments. I sure am. However, you are not actually a member of the crew yet. There's another task you have to complete before you can join the crew of the HMN side squad. But why? Am I not slutty enough? Do I have to like show my button technique? Um, I mean, am I a bottom? Uh, I, like usually in this kind of dating sims, I'm, I'm you're supposed to be the bottom or something. So I hope not. I always want to be birds because I want to explore all the possible options. Wait, oh no, I thought all the tests were over. I thought I was already a member of the crew. I showed my butt to people. Oh my god, show your butt in public. Don't worry, it should be pretty easy to pay attention. Oh. I just need to become certified in the emergency producing of the ship. Is there any... Every crisis, every staff member is expected to know what to do. I'm going to give you a three hour course of the emergency producers of the HMN size queen. This is both for space and see trouble. At the end of the course, you'll be tested once you pass your test. I'll certificate you. And you can <laughs> you can officially join the crew. Are there any questions so far? Yeah. Horse? <laughs> How is this ship able to travel through space when the decks are all open like this? That's a good question. Yeah, oh actually. <laughs> that's actually a good a very good question. Also, I thought we were like monsters and everything, not like aliens, but... I mean, I guess it's the same in a way, right? It's a different species, like something different from usually normal Earth, I guess. I agree. When we're flying through space, a reticular seal is still around the open de desk. This gives guests a 360 degree view of our space fly flights. There it is. <laughs> Around the water, we retract the seal, letting the sun and fresh air. Wow. Any other questions? Where will, where will the ship be going next? Wow, you really are eager, aren't you? I sure am to be the number one slot of the entire ship. <laughs> we'll be cruising the waters of the land. Lamdromeda. Pleasure moon. Each one has large tropical beaches in the unique cultures and activities. That sounds amazing. Oh, it is. And that's just it for the week. We have lots of wonderful places to explore. I'm so happy. So happy to be a... S I need to stop saying that word. <laughs> but we need to get your membership certificate out of the way first. We're here, I'm going to get your life jacks. Li life jackets. Life jacks. <laughs> I worked so hard to get here and they're literally hiring ex-cons? I can't help but wonder what Hars did. Wait, did I miss something? Wait, is he a, like a criminal? What? What? 
<laughs> Did I actually miss something in the dialogue? What the fuck? What the fudge? I can't help but wonder what Hars did. Um, I don't know. This sounds so judgmental. Uh, I will say this. So, um, you guys now get out of prison. Smooth, me, real nonchalant. No. But didn't you say? I'm still in prison, sugar tits. I'm being renamed to the Curse of the Captain for work release. I don't understand. But well, not to understand, I'm here to work. I do a good job, keep my nose clean and I get to keep working. I fuck up. <laughs> I fuck up. <laughs> and then it's back to better time. So you have to be a sex worker or you're going to be thrown back into prison. Well, it was this hap to shit. I could have been a minor on Cyrus 1 if I wanted. I picked this job and fought hard as well to get into it. Of, eh, of course you did. Of course you did. Oh. You don't think this is a sweet gig? I do, I think it's a great job. I worked really hard to get there too. Here, too. Nice, then do me a favor, let's keep up a background between the two of us. I had to tell that Chris director guy who I was. Ain't no reason for anyone else to know. Shouldn't the others know what there's a criminal working with us? It must be hard for him to be accepted. Bro, he's doing his pain, his dude, he's trying to be a good citizen. Like, don't be judgmental already. It's our first day. I don't want to <laughs> I don't want enemies already. Sure, I understand. Here we are, now follow me to the life falls jump on escape pods. Oh my god. I love the little transition with the boat. Good work, you two. Your boat certificate to handle emergency on the HSI screen. And can... And can... Ugh. And can proceed with your intake. Welcome aboard. Yay! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, what am I saying? What the fuck? Milo, head to the clinic on the deck three. Hars, you're with me. Oh my god, what, what are we doing? What is happening here? Um Um Here's the here's the clinic. I wonder why he asked me to come here. I had my universal vaccine to prevent all binary diseases. It beers is already damn that's sweet i actually want one of them <laughs> that would be great like you have a vaccine for every kind of disease just multiple fucking hell yes i want one <laughs> are you kidding me <laughs> they gave me really lovely physical before i could even apply for the job too wait was there something about an optional stamina treatment in the brochure I should have read it more carefully. More stamina will be pretty great though. Uh, oh my god. Um, uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> ah, my throat. Are you okay? Oh my god, a perfect doctor. He looks similar to somebody from a video game. I don't know where I see this face. So, so, you're the new crewmate. And what's funny, you are. <laughs> oh my god, he's a creep. <laughs> I'm a dick dog. Oh my god. The innuendos in the game, in the names, I'm sorry. Uh, at your service. Dick dog, you're the doctor? Indeed. You may have it consider me your salvation. What? A gorgeous young man such as yourself will be immensely popular. You are an earthling, one with traveling limitations. Your... your car can only come so many times in a day. Your arse can only stretch a car with a size to your own. Oh my but thanks to this revolutionary treatment, you'll become the hardest tax charge stallion this work demands. My god. With a bit of adventures to come and come and come 
to the light of every case who requires you. Really? Then you wish your ass will self <laughs> and they will stretch without pain or damage the committed even the greediest of planet on Oh my god. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, <laughs> oh, what's the remaining delightful in time? I still be tied. Um, oh my God, this this is actually a creep. I'm actually creeped out. Wait, you're going to perform surgery on me? No surgery, my dear lad. Injections, one in the testicles and another in your anal ring. Within that day, you'll become the harness that required to deflame in Star Cruising Line. The effects last eight months, long enough for you to complete your first tour. I see. This must be the optional stamina treatment. It sounds incredible. I wouldn't have to worry if it was lucky enough for this job anymore. Oh, sorry, that was <laughs> that was Milo. If it is lucky, even my stupid big brother will have to shut up about it. Sounds pretty good. Are there any side effects? Only if you consider a perpetual horniness. A sad effect. I assure you, my dear man, at this moment such a thing is an asset. And an option it may be, I recommended it most truthfully. Think of it, with one head quest, uh, 300 stuff, as uh, <laughs> oh my god. Think of it, we fa fight 1007... 17k. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not so good with the English numbers. Yes, in 300 step, your gorgeous flesh and ass will shine like a beacon to everyone on board. Dang! <laughs> oh my. Do you wish to revel in your work? To eagerly, excitedly welcome to advance of every guest? Or do you want to be all sex out on your very first day? I, ne I never want to be going all sexed out. Though I figure I will just pleasure people with my mouth, arse, and hands a lot, not coming all the time. Do you think they can take a pleasure for a man with a perpetual fleshy dog? I mean, it wouldn't always be flaccid. It must always be erect. Always? <laughs> I won't get the strain, cramps and not nose, right? No one says, your tender member will consistently self-renew. Flaming Star Cruise Line are not boasted by brushes. We guarantee the enthusiasm of every member of our staff. And this demonstrated by thick pulsing and spurting cocks. Well, <laughs> I wanted to be the very best that no one ever was. Oh my <laughs> Got the um, Pokemon reference. Splendid. Then it's settled. Now this rub and set into the back. Alright. Set your butt on the table. Now lay back. Spray your legs while your feet on the strips. Jeez. Scoot forward. Scoot forward. A bit more. <laughs> we left your lascivious open to me. You really enjoy your work. How can I help but enjoy such wretched vision as yourself now then? <laughs> Ouch! What was that sound, horny jail? Now for your deck. Your deck! Oh, and my deck! <laughs> and it's done! Here's a lollipop. Wow, thanks. Are you sure this works? I don't feel any differences. D different. It takes some time for the serum to primitive the flesh. Have no fear. By lamb chop tomorrow you will know the full benefits of the treatment. <gasps> Sounds good. Um speaking of lunch, I'm starving. It's your dinner time. Head to the staff staff mess hall about the tech too. Great. See you Doctor. Thanks for the penis and ass upgrade. <sighs> A job well done, it is our reward. <laughs> my god that was a uh, that was a moment
Wow, look at this spread. Look at, at this spread. This is really all of those workers. Of course, I. Of course, I insist. The new Queen's fed and same quality of food as the gas. I'm a good food in the hardest standard in the galaxy. Uh, oh my god. He looks like an aquatic monster. Kind of weird, but I like the design. No, yeah, it's not bad. See this canopies? That is real blah 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 muscles. You know how hard they are to produce. I have no idea what it is. Wow, I'll be sure to try. Wow, I'll be sure to try that. Why am I mixing the... Why am I mixing the voices? You will? Sure, it sounds like you made a lot of trouble to get them. Are you the chef here? I'm Excelic. I had a chef in charge of the food servers of HM9 Size Queen. I'm Miller, the new deckhand. Are you a guardman, Miller? I wouldn't say that, but I do love to eat good food. Same here, honestly. But the right food because we have to bottom here. The food I serve are excellent the quality of very good food. Try this mushroom tart. Nope. Oh, that is the most delicious thing I ever eaten. You you really think so? It's incredible, I can't believe I'll get to eat such great food. Um well of course. And one of the greatest chefs in the galaxy after all. Everyone knows how great you are, Excel. Like, oh my god. Oh, hello. Oh, hola, papi. Oof. Oof. Damn. I don't know if it is an alien, but damn. Oof. Nice. Hardly. My talents are wasted on a crew who will be happy with cold sandwiches and breast 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 today. Sounds like you got the... Sounds like you got a new guy to try out your tart. Hi, I'm Bruno, the head bartender. Nice to meet you, I'm Milo, the new deckhand. I've been looking forward to meet you. Milo. <laughs> You're going to start work serving drinks in my department. Really? Stop hugging him, he was just a try one of my knuckles. Oh, sure. Oh, damn, dude. We are, we are already ripped with this fine... Six, actually eight pack. <laughs> Damn. We don't have to like ruin our physique with chunky food. Mm, that was even more delicious than the tart. I knew you would love it. It's the rare book albums I worked so hard to get them. It was definitely worth the trouble. Oh. Oh, Milo, looks like you're becoming Excel's favorite crew. But He'll feed you like crazy if you let him in. <laughs> I don't know what voice to give to Bruno. <laughs> he looks so uh, like powerful that I think every <laughs> every voice will not work. How will I keep from gaining weight when there's such a great food here? Now try this and this. I just made a fresh batch damn thing that ten minutes ago. Chop, yum, chop. Wrap it like it's hot. I wouldn't worry too much, Milo. You're going to running around this big ship, burning a lot of calories. We're also required to work out naked at least three hours a week in the statnasium for any guests who would like to watch us wear it. Oh, damn. <laughs> so you're pretty much telling me that this is a ship, a cruise for, um,. Sex addict people, right? <laughs> I mean, if, if, why not? Uh, if it is to release sexual tension and stuff like that, so it works. It works. At least, hey, at least they're not forcing people or like hurting people, right? That's the nice thing about it. Like, if it is consens consensual, consensual. <laughs> Yeah, if it is, you know what you, you know what I mean. Um, then it's fine. It's fine. Like everybody does that. Everybody wants some woohoo moments, like to release frustration. Oh, good. I was hoping there was a gym here. 
If anything, you'd be more likely to lose weight than gaining it. No, no, why watch here? Try this rust grassling. It's been marinated for three days to get this delicious crackly skin. Uh, I'll be nice. Uh, I mean, only because you have a good design as an alien, <laughs> I guess. I love crackling skin. It's my favorite food. What do you mean? I will crackle your skin, you fishy bitch. <laughs> Why didn't you just hand your try over to Selig and let him stock up your best lunch offering? Give me that tray! <laughs> sure thing, obviously you know what is the best. <laughs> Finally, someone willing to try new things. <laughs> Don't pay him any mind, he's stuck in the kitchen when he have guests, so he hardly gets any feedback. Most of the crew here just want to comf comfort food from their home planets. They don't give much of his fancy stuff a try. I'm all about trying new stuff. I came here to have an amazing sexy 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 adventure. That's a great attitude. It sounds like you're going to fit in just fine. Enjoy your lunch, then come to the main bar on the deck nine. And see me. I'll get your training started. Sure thing. You ready to try my rag space lamp? Oh excel, I think that's enough! Can eat his own body weight, blah, 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 blah. I'm gonna become fucking fat and nobody will, not, will date me in this cruise. <laughs> that's that's the rule of the case. <laughs> you must to be fit. <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> well, unless you're, you're a person that doesn't care about looks. Those are the best people. You'll be assigned a section to the desk and will be responsible for bringing those guests their drink. Just write that down. What they want. The number of the deck chair and bring us the tickets. Me or one of the other bartenders will make your order right away. Then you deliver the drinks to the guests. You will be able to remember who gets what by the numbers of the desk chairs. This sounds pretty easy so far. Yep, don't want to overwhelm you when you when you're just starting out, but there's a few more things you have to learn. It doesn't matter if you're a server, a cabin steward, or a bartender. This is a gay sex cruise, and your member of the job is to pleasure the guest. <laughs> At any time. <laughs> that is literally pressure, but sure. At any time, one of the guests could decide what they want, some extra special treatment from you. You must always be available for that. If you're asked to join someone in your cabin somewhere, somewhere else off deck, tell the tell the floater on duty to take over your section and go with the guest. Sometimes guests will want to have fun with you right on the deck in front of everyone. Damn. Of course, some people like an audience. It adds to their excitement. But but wouldn't it be that embarrassing? I don't want to make things awkward for all the other guests around them. Hmm. Are you really worried about the others, Milo? Or you worry about everyone seeing you have sex? I mean, I know this will be part of the job. It's just sometimes I'm worried that I'm not a slut enough. It's kind of because of my big. It's because of my big brother. He's been putting me down ever since I found out I wanted to work with flaming star crystal lines. I mean, I <laughs> Your brother has all the rights to bully you. Look at you, fuck you, horrible slut. <laughs> I'm joking. I don't want to slate. Sl slate? Sl slut shaming nobody. Like, you do you, buddy. He says I'm frigid, a total prude, and I will never be slutty enough to cut it in the Flaming Star Cruise. Hmm. I'm glad you were honest with me, Milo. First thing first, we don't use the word slut or slutty on this ship. These were judgmental. And insinuate that being sexually free is a bad thing that you might be ashamed of. He's so wise, oh my god. <laughs> it's like an elderly, not so elderly. Oh, actually, I have no idea how much his age is. So he may be like a thousand years old than me. I guess I have to watch what I say around here. Um, He's so wise. We're not ashamed of being sexually free here. See, sex is a need. Just like eating or sleeping, our cruise ship offers a safe, safe place where people can explore their needs without any shame 
sounds actually very nice, honestly. It doesn't sound like very judgmental at all. So, it's a positive, it's positive, positive, ugh. it's a positive thing. That's the word that I was trying to say. <laughs> that say, some of the guests are their very first sex crews and are just beginning to get comfortable with their bodies. They knew I was taught to be conf confident and caring, to help them come out of the shells and have the best time of their lives. If you're hesitant and scared me though, you're going to make them feel like they're doing something wrong. You're going to have a bad experience. Oh no, I never even thought, thought of that. But how can I be confident and caring when I've never done this kind of work before? Maybe my asshole big brother was right. Maybe I'm just not, of, not cut off of, for this. Calm down, take a deep breath, stop panicking. Fleming Star Cruise Line puts every new hire through a rigorous application process before they can even consider that as a staff member. <coughs> Excuse me? The fact that they hire you means that you are cut off. You are cut off for this. You just have the same first time jitters that we all get. You're going to, go You're going to do great, Milo. But how can I be sure? How can I be sure? I actually don't want to be like standard um, cruise member. I want to be the number one cruise member. It's a lot of the cruise. I mean, it, it, it's not me that say it. It's Milo that say it. He's the one like he, that's his goal. So because we have a ceremony for all new crew members, that will help break the ice and get rid of the nerves. Really? Really, don't worry about it. I can tell you, you want to be the best you can. You have the right attitude, you just need a little experience. Then you have all the confidence you need to give our guests a great experience. I believe in you, Milo. Thanks, Bruno. All the new crew men report to the cockpit. Uh, <laughs> looks like it's time for you to meet Captain Taurus. We'll continue our training later. Taurus? Is he a bull or something? Hello? Oh. <laughs> Case and point. Of course he is. Such a cow. <laughs> I already decide who am I going to date. Oh, damn. She looks great. Hello there. You must be one of the new crewmates. How Captain Taurus. Pleased to meet you. Milo Burr. Pleased to meet you, sir. That's odd. I thought you were two of you. There were two of you. Ah, oh, there was. Oh, no matter. I'm sure you will be along. What do you think of the HMSI Sex Queen, Milo? She's a real beauty, sir. I'm so honored to be here. Wonderful, I'm glad to hear that. Is she everything you expected? Yes, sir, she's exactly what I imagined the flash trick of Flame is Star Cruise Line to be. I worked so hard to get here. It was my dream to travel the galaxy on a super fun sexy ship. Wow, you're an adventurer, just like me. Travel the galaxy is what I live for. But not just the no galaxy. I go beyond the star charts, penetrated deep into the darkest corners of the universe. Yeah, that, that's definitely an innuendo right there, <laughs> Captain. But I'll, 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 I'll allow it. I will allow it because you're looking fine to me as well. Really? Yes. Before I came to the H HMS side, I keep saying, <laughs> for some reason, <laughs> I keep saying H&M. <laughs> I don't want no fucking H&M. Um, Damn, uh, sorry, HMS size screen. <laughs> I spent 30 years on an explore, exploratory mission. I navigated through the far, the far reaches of space. Wow, too many complicated words today, damn. For me at least. Oh, you can imagine the things I've seen, Milo. And yet, I barely stretched the surface. How did you end up with cruising ship? I chose to post my mission for a year to join the Flaming Star Cruise Lines. You see, Milo, the captain's chair is so solitary one. I saw until majesty into three ambassadors of space. But what is beauty when you have no one to share with it? What are wonders when there's no one to experience it? That old with you. I had enough loneliness. Oh. 
So I decided to spend a year on the captain of the gay sex curse the shit to see if I could find myself a husband. Oh, he's also looking for a husband. I see, I see. Someone with the same thirst of adventure as me. Oh, wow, good luck, sir. Horse! <laughs> Yo! Ah, you must be Horse, my work release crewman. What keep you? I had to vacuum cleaner run and didn't hear the speakers. I was just telling Milo here about the first of our adventure. Are you exploring also, Horse? No, I don't enough of that shit. Just got me in trouble. Into trouble. Ah, well, I see. Carry on then, gentlemen. So, um, how was your first day? About what I expected, you? This ship is amazing! There's a lot of, like, hunks, dudes, around. Like, damn, I feel in heaven. <laughs> For real, if, I, if that was me in real life, I would be in heaven. I'm not even joking. Like, damn. My god. You hear about this... You hear about this ceremony we're going to go through? Oh, oh the bartender Bruno mentioned it, but he didn't go into details. Apparently we're getting... <laughs> God! In front of everyone, so we ain't no <laughs> bashful later. What? Yep, looks like the fun started when they ain't even let them into stock yet. <laughs> You're not nervous? Heck no, I could take the... The dingling of having of these hotties, or give them it to just as hard. Might even teach them a thing or two. Oh, he's a burst? Oh. Milo. Uh, I mean, horse. Um, yeah, second option if Taurus doesn't work. I wish I was as confident as you. My advice, have fun. I don't like you go to marry one of these fuckers. Doesn't mean shit. Well, of course not, but I wasn't even thinking about that. Good, then you'll be fine. Still, what's the harm of getting close to one of the other workers? Psst, maybe it's no harm for you. Oh, sorry. Still, still, what's the harm of getting close to one of the other workers? Psst, maybe it's not hard for you, but I got the packages. Ain't nobody going to want to hook up with the likes of me. Oh, don't be it. Oh, well. It depends. I was about to say, don't be, don't, don't be so like, so harsh on yourself, man. You're good looking, but I think he meant like, because he's a criminal and stuff. If I start getting all romantic and shit, I'm just going to bite me. You're just going to bite me in the ass. I mean, maybe you will like it. Why is he so defensive? Defensive. <laughs> anyway, we're supposed to pick out who we want to do it. We have to pick. Yep. First you go to ask them if they're willing to train you. Then you pick them on the ceremony. I gotta hit the shower and make sure you're my ass is clean. Nice job, Hars. Do shin for the moment. I guess a ceremony like this will break the ice. Once I have the sex with one of the crew members in front of everyone, I won't have any reason to be nervous about it later. But I know who to pick it just got here. I better get back to my cabin and fresh up, freshen up. <clears throat> All right, whoever, who are we going to choose? Uh, so far, I think I have a lot of options. Definitely Bruno, he's gonna let me, and the chef dude. Probably Hars. I, 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 I'm, let's see, let's see. If I get to that point, I want I want it to be Taurus. Yes, that's my first action. Although Hars, he's green. I love green, and he looks fine. Ah, we'll see. What the heck? I'm getting a boner, but I never get horny in the shower. I was just cleaning myself, giving me wood. Or maybe I started to feel the effects of the injection. Make the letter colder and think on sexy thoughts. Like the resolution of the reformation of high level. Political mechanism focus the time of progression. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Politics in my game? No. No. Please. I have a net politics in real life. Dang it. It's not working. If anything, it's just getting hard. <laughs> getting a boner for politics. That sounds like a lot of people on Twitter. 
What am I going to do? I can't, oh, I can't walk around like this. My afro will stay down. There's only one option. Check like I'm a Spider-Man rubbing his <laughs> Punch myself in the dick. Punch myself in the dick! <laughs> Whoa! Uh, okay, that took care of it. I just hope I didn't break it. Alright, before you all judging me, saying like, Oh my god, how could I just not do the choice? We wanted to see it. I just want the real action. I want to be, I want to be prepared for the uh, initiation. Come on. Come on. We need to get ready. We we, we cannot waste um, our milk for <laughs> for the shower. We need to keep prepared. Come on. Come on, come on. That's better. I'm fresh, clean, and ready for anything. Exactly. Um, hello? Uh, I guess you are sharing this, this cabin. Oh. I got caught in the bunch of work. I finally got a chance to get away. I took the top, the top bunk. Is that okay? Fine by me. I'm taking a shower. Ah, uh, see you. Oh, come in. Oh, hi, Axel. So, there are your quarters, hmm? I remember when I too had the tiny scabby on the ship. I had a shadow with another roommate. Really? You started out from the bottom? In the eighth, I was fresh of the culinary school and came aboard as a junior chef of one of many. It took many years of working hard of running myself before I tended to love the status I know. I'm surprised that your food is so good, I figured you were some. Oh, dumb, sorry. I keep mixing the voices, I'm sorry. <clears throat> I'm surprised your food is good, I figured you were some famous chef. They brought on board. You, you assume I was? Oh. Um, anyways, the reason I keep this is, by, is that I'm trying out a new meatball recipe. I thought you might tell me what you think. Sure, I'll love to eat anything that you make. Uh. Oh, it's so tasty. Can I have one of your bowls? <laughs> Wait, now it's a little biter. I knew it. I knew I put too many herbs. I will change the recipe at once. It means... It's not bad. I mean, it's not bad. Not bad isn't good enough for the edge of a side screen. <laughs> okay, wherever you think is best. Well then, I'll be going. Um, oh, he's blushing. What are you about to say? <laughs> you could pick me as your training tonight if you wanted. Oh. See, I told you. He will be an option, for sure. Because I accept all his food. You stinky fishy. It's just stinky. It's just stinky. <laughs> I got STDs. They made my coochie itch. <laughs> okay, sorry. Really? If you wish. Wow, at least I have one guy who will be willing to. Come in. Oh, hi, Bruno. Are you another option? Oh, hi, Milo. How are you still in? Pretty good. Um. Was I supposed to go back to the bar after I saw the captain? That's okay. We're playing in a little fast and loose today. We can work a training you more tomorrow. Oh, good. I know you're really nervous, but you don't have to worry. Pretty soon you know this ship like this, like the back of your hand. I really hope so. If I fell off this job, I lose all hope. I wanted to work at this cruise line my whole adult life. <laughs> then it's meant to be. I was in your shoes once. Really? I'd gone to school for a long time and I had a lot of fancy degrees. When I started out in the corporate world, it just didn't feel right. I didn't want to drop behind the desk. At the same time, I felt like I had more to give the world than just by my brains. Oh. Brains and body. Mm-hmm. It took a lot of soul searching before I ended up in this ship. Once I got there, everything felt in place. The war started making sense to me again. You feel me? Not really, to be honest. I'm curious about you now. <laughs> That's nice to hear. I'm sure we get to know each other better. Maybe we could even start tonight. I mean, if you want. Oh, uh, feel free to pick me as your training at the ceremony. <laughs> no pressure. It won't hurt my feelings if you pick someone else. I just wanted you to know there is your vision is if you need me. That's awesome, thank you. You bet. 
Wow, started to feel a lot better about tonight. I'm glad he stopped. Oh, damn. Come in. Oh my god, how many options for tonight? <laughs> if you're another option, I already know what I want. For my training. Uh, hello, Captain. Oh, uh, hello there, Milo. I just came here by, by check on you. How was my first day on the HMS as a queen? It was everything I hoped for, sir. I keep having to pinch myself to make sure I'm not dreaming. Wonderful, you're going to fit in just fine. I have high hopes for you, crewman. Really? I don't see any reason why you couldn't climb up the ranks in the very first year. This could be a long and lucrative career for you. That would be amazing, my life dream come true. Well, I'm happy for you, but don't get too attached to the H HMS Ice Queen. Fleming Star Cruise Line has over a dozen ships. You could be assigned to any of the any of them of your next voyage. Wow, well, I never thought of that. But any ship would be great. Any ship? As long as I'm traveling the galaxy and having a good time, I'll be honored to be aboard of any ship that will help me. Hmm, is that right? What about a different kind of ship, say an exploratory vessel? What about this? Exploring galaxy even if you're your own with strange and alive discoveries. Does that gotta get your heart pumping, crewman? Oh! Oh, option! Uh um uh that sounds even more incredible working cruise ship. And a sick ship that sounds even more incredible. Um I feel if I choose this, he will say, Hey, I can train you tonight. You can you can use me as an option. So I'm going with this. <laughs> okay, from here on out, I will be my own choices. Will do my own choices without thinking too much of like, Oh my god, am I, am I gonna date this dude or not? Because I don't want... I usually prefer making my choices than... Choosing what is for the spicy scenes or stuff like that. So even though I mean I think regardless, the majority of my choices usually lead to the spicy scenes. <laughs> oh really? I'm glad to hear you say that. That's what you normally do, isn't it? Yes, that's the lonely part of my life is taken. I love exploring, but long for someone to share it with all with. Okay, but to be fair. You have explored all the galaxy, you will find at least one person that wants to travel with you. Like, come on, it's not that impossible. And, and Unless you're a, you're very picky when it comes to men. But enough of a talk. And I will be a very special ceremony for you on ours. It's a way to break the ice. And get you comfortable performing sex work in front of our fellow crew members. Yes, Bruno told me a little about it. It's natural to be nervous. But don't be afraid, Dennis. Everyone on this ship has valuable experience. They know how to break you in the gen in gently and with all the care you need. That's good, although I like it rough. Rough. Like making me <laughs> destroy. <it>. I'm joking. <laughs> although him. I gotta tell you, man, Taurus. Makes me feel a lot of emotions. A lot of emotions. That I will, I be, be willing to, you know, explore new things, especially rough things. You're allowed to pick whoever you want as a trainer, but I have to agree. Also, it's best to pick someone who's already told you they're willing. Like me, like me, sorry, <laughs> like me. <laughs> you, sir? That's right. I'd be happy to train you. In fact, I'd be the most skilled mentor you could choose. That's how I attained the rank of captain after all. Take me to get the 5 star treatment. You get the chance to give it all out and refer a good sexy cat also. Damn, how can I refuse? Oh. See, I don't know, I might be a more intimidated than one of your fellow crewmen. I want you to be as comfortable as possible during your training. If you pick someone else, I won't be the last bit offended. I mean that, Milo. Thank you, I appreciate that. Whoever you pick will sh have shared a very special experience with you. It will be your fir very first time on the HMS side screen. You should pick someone you really like. Someone you'll be happy to have the incredible intimidation with. 
Okay, let's just not make it too much that, that deep. Like, we're literally like a kind of prostitutes in a ship, in a way. Not even prostitutes, because technically. I mean, in a way, I don't want to shame nobody, but let's be real. I understand. I think I think really hard about it. Very good, crewman. Carry on then. He's right. This is a big decision. It could be a normal training session, or something special. Maybe the blossom with me and whoever I pick because of this experience. Wait, does that mean whoever I pick is gonna be my route for the dating? God, I really hope not. I want to experiment each of them, like all of them. I should pick the person I like most of all. You ready to head up? Shut up, I'm just so nervous. Yeah, you're really pretty innocent, ain't ya? No, I'm not I'm just as smart as anyone else on this ship. Or at least I hope so. <laughs> Damn. Fake it until you make it, buddy. I didn't mean that as an insult. I think it's cute. A guy like you is going to be real popular in this ship. You really think so? It's obvious, and I have your... And I know you're a dirty slut too! <laughs> My god, so direct. Oh, thank you! They think we need to get training. The fuck? The fuck good, but we're pros already, ain't we? I mean... Are we? I... I really don't know. I mean, I did practice a lot before... I mean, I did practice a lot before I got this job. If you want, we could pick each other for the ceremony. Really? Yeah, we could show them we don't need no training. We're just as slavish as the rest of them. Yeah, <laughs> sure. <laughs> of course you agree, Milo. Then again, they might have special producers for this shit. Getting trained by one of the veterans might be a good idea. I leave it. I leave it up to you. Oh fuck them! I leave it up to you. I'm good with whatever you decide. Won't be the hard feel. Won't won't be no hard feelings either way. I'm sorry. I'm getting uh mixed up with the with the voices and the reading. Oof. Me too. Thanks, horse. See you up there. Oh my. Oh my god, we're ready. We are ready to pick. All right. Okay. Okay, you two, everyone's gathered at the main deck for your ceremony. I hope you're excited. I'm excited and nervous. But you like to drink, Jim? We don't have a lot to drink when we're on duty. But you can consume limited alcohol when we're serving the guests or for the ceremony. I wanted to keep you now to get drunk, but just one strong drink to take the edge of your nerves. That sounds good, but I just brush my teeth. Brush my teeth. So I don't want the amount to taste like alcohol. Good call. You should always make sure you got a fresh, kissable mouth. I recommend drinking Miss My Interest as one of the Edge and Best Green specialties. It's a strong drink, but your breath will still stay fresh and your mouth won't taste bad. I'm okay. Well, I'll just have a little one. Make mine a double. You got it. While I'm whipping this up, let me go over some things. Each of you has a stack of paperwork, like you're in your cabin among the paperwork in your sex manual. We're expected to read that the normal producers, we have the play sex work, this manual is super important. Alright, this is all the explanation. You need to know the standard steps to graduation of the HMS High Screen. Right now, all the paperwork crew members are upset from the decks, they're relaxing and having drinks of their own. When you come out, the captain is going to be giving you about a welcome speech. And he's going to ask you how to pick you like the terrain. I mean, okay, sure. I mean, we, we got that explained a thousand times. The train at the same time will be less embarrassing to go train the experience with someone else. Here's your thing, horse. You know, the first thing you're training will do is discuss what happened with you. You should always have this discussion with the guests or guests you're serving before you start. Ask them what they like to do or have done if they don't know, make the sexiest suggestion you can think of. Try not to kill the mood while you have this discussion. Watch your expression while you talk, yada yada yada. There's something else, they're going to hear on. Alright, alright, I mean, pretty much standard stuff. Here's your drink, Milo. Thank you. Well, that is great, and my mouth feels freshened. 
Remember, it's your job to try to give the guests a great experience. Don't think about your like the most. Think about what the guests most enjoy, their happiness, the gold, and necessary getting good to come. I'm already a little buzzed. The thing was super strong. Take your time, servicing the guests is your most important job. You can spend all night with the same guests. That's what they want. These are great tips. Thank you, Milo. Uh, <laughs> honestly, honestly, move on. <laughs> I'm sorry. A couple more things, just so you know. If you're tapping someone, you want to be, you want to follow the processes in your sex manner to properly lubricate and penetrate. Be extra careful with this and take your time. If you're one of the top days, you have stamina treatment for tick -tick, You don't need. It. Okay, I get it. Nice. We didn't have done the stamina treatment. Okay, 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 okay. This is all the rules, the rules and everything. I pretty much did everything. You know, look it all the time. Treatment. I got the treatment. What about you, Angel Nuts? Yep, I got it right after safety certification. I mean, they, they literally... G give it to me, like, without no choice. Like, <laughs> I had to, so... But I don't think it's kicking all the way yet. Wait, I'm glad you both decided to do it. To do that. It makes work here a lot more fun. It does take 18 hours for you to fully feel the effects, but you'll really notice your ass taking a cock easier and being very social. <laughs> you'll be excited to use loop for your training. Do you go over the section manual? Um, yep, yeah, definitely. I read it all. I've been studying the... <laughs> yep, I've been sending the copy that was mailed up to me when I got the job. Oh, he actually did. Never mind. I wanted to lie a little bit, but eh. I flipped it right. We'll read it in more tonight. Good. Did you have any questions? Yeah, I got a drink. Unfortunately, I guess your first drink was a double, so I won't be able to give you another one. You might bring your blood alcohol level to your become unable to contest. Psst. I know what I'm sitting up for. It's important that you all have your faculties that you can learn from your training also. All right. Okay, I think you better represent it with the ceremony. Have fun! There we go! Who am I going to choose? Uh, wow, everybody who works on this ship is here. I hope everything goes okay. Gentlemen, welcome to the HM9 Side Screen, the ultimate ship of sexual pleasure. We see a single goal here leave no cock and come. Yay! Woo! <laughs> Stuck for <three> times! ha <laughs> ha! Today you've been training in safety, you turned in the ship, you've been given a taste of each of your jobs, but you're still not really a member of this group. What? You think merely showing your ass is enough to get the ticket on board the HSN Queen? <laughs> no, hell no, nice ass, woo! <laughs> oh my god. These people. We want to see your blazing hardcocks, we want to see your squared come by butt clocks. Oh my god. It's time, my man, time to swap the dads with your mob dicks. Oh yeah, show us your cracks. <laughs> oh my god, these people in the audience, I swear to god. Maybe I should have had a second drink. Now then, let's give this crew member a proper welcome. Who here will be training our sweet new deckman here, Milo? I run ahead, shut up. They all want to f oh, me. I'm so proud, so humbled. Well, my dear Milo, looks like you have to pick one of the crew member and your captain, too, if you wish. Who will you pop your sea grape? My god. Oh god, how I can choose this is so much pressure. I show you some pressure, pick me, <laughs> not me, look at how huge I am. Give me that sweet pie hole. Rawr. <laughs> My god. Um Excel Hearts Bruno I mean of course my choice is this, but I don't know Hars. It looks mighty fine. Taurus. Captain Taurus. Did I hear you right? Oh my god, look at his face. Did I hear you right? Did you just choose your dear captain to train you? Well, I figure you're the one I can learn from the most from. <laughs> Wonderful. I was hoping you pick me. Now don't be nervous, I promise to be kind and gentle. I won't take the, this opportunity for granted. He's splashing, he really wants to, me to pick him. I can't believe this great man wanted to be the one training me. I felt so Honoring his presence makes me happy. A fine choice, Grimman. Very fine. Now move on to our stilly horse. 
Who here will train our newest cabin steward? There's a lot less people raising their hands for hearts than there were for me. I don't understand, why... Why would I be more popular than him? Me, fuck me, fuck this... Stuck my car... <laughs> wow! <laughs> How does it hurt his feelings? I'll take a suck. Oh, damn! Oh, me? You raised my hand, but I didn't think you'd be interested. Sure, I'm in the exact spot. <laughs> oh my god. Very well, let, let the training begin. Oh my god. I'm so damn nervous as well, Milo. Oh, oh, the music. Of course, the music started playing. Is it really okay for me to do this with the captain, though? The thought of having public sex is very enough without having to do it with the most important person on the ship. If I mess up, I'll be 10, maybe even 20 times more humiliating. God, I shouldn't have thought this trace through better. No need to make that face. You're going to do well, I know you are. Sir, take a deep breath and try to relax. You'll think this is lovely, I'll take the lead. As you need to do is follow my direction. Okay, I'll follow your lead. Oh, Captain Terry is so kind and pressure. Like the daddy everyone wants to do life. How in the world is this man still single? He sure seems like a hot catch to me. This is how he runs the ship. This is no one to drop here and in such a high demand. Come closer, crew and crew mate. And take your off your apron. We started your training off by being a proper demonstration of preparation for anal sex. Oh <laughs> yes sir. Oh damn! Hey flops. Is your gamer girl back at it again on YouTube? To watch the full video head on over to my Twitter. The link is in the description box. Okay, but I wanted to see hearts training as well. Ah, oh, the captain is is dressing again. I should probably get my upper on too. <laughs> that was an experience. Damn, that was pretty nice. I knew you were going to be a great new addition to our crew. You were wonderful, Milo. Thank you, sir. That means a lot. Was a bit nervous, but I hope it didn't affect my performance too badly. Press the pressure, you perform as much as the audience. <laughs> Captain Torres is a real sweetheart. Not about to rush into marriage, but maybe seeing her things go with it wouldn't be so bad. A date or two with a heart, right? Or a marriage? I want a marriage. He's handsome, kind, considerate, and he has a huge dick. Can you really ask for more in a man? Maybe also be a, be a birth style, would be perfect. If this is what every, every, every day of the HMSI screen is going to be like, I'm going forward to it, sir. Hold on, you're not quite a member of the crew yet, Jet. You want more right to initiate, you must challenge the obstacle yet. What? What else do I have to do to join the crew? My god! Ugh. Wow, no matter how long I'm here, I just keep finding a new spot of calm. <laughs> god. Oh, look at this nice painting, I don't know who the fuck is it. Well! Alright, I'm gonna end this here, then it was a nice journey. Um, let me know, whoever the fuck is watching here, this, if you want me to continue this series. I hope everybody is having a great day and bye!